You're watching a commercial presentation on behalf of Cruise Savers UK. Welcome to Cruise Savers, and here's your host, Dom Tolly. Hello and welcome to Cruise Savers. I'm Dom, and over the next 15 minutes, I've got three more delightfully discounted deals, especially for you. Now, if you see any of the cruises that you want on our Caribbean special today, just give us a call. It's 0800 011 1055. That's 0800 011 1055. 10.55. Now, as I said, it is a Caribbean special here today, but we're not only taking you to the Caribbean. Oh no, we've got stays in New York, we've got stays in Niagara Falls, and we've got stays in Las Vegas included in some of our cruises on today's show. Now, if none of the cruises that you see float your boat, then just visit our website. It's www.cruisesavers.co.uk. Remember to log on, subscribe, and then you've got access to all of our fantastic discounted deals. So we've got lots to get through today, so let's get underway with cruise number one. And we are cruising the Caribbean with Royal Caribbean International. And we're cruising Sin City, the Big Apple, and the Bahamas on the Anthem of the Seas. So let's have a little look on board the Anthem. Now, the Anthem of the Seas is part of the Quantum class of ship, and the Quantum class hold a very special, uh, special place in my heart. I was, it was actually the first ship, the first cruise ship I ever went on, and uh, this, was, I was, this was filmed while I was actually on board. It's got so much to do. It is one of the smart ships. There is the uh, Ripcord by iFly, there's Johnny Rockets there, you've got the Solarium in, inside there, and at the very front of the ship, You've also got a beautiful adult-only solarium where you can relax and enjoy the trickling, cascading waterfalls down there with fantastic views over the front of the ship. And believe me, when you're in the Bahamas, those views will be amazing. You've got the Flow Rider there on back deck. And above that, you've got the Ripcord by iFly, which is the skydiving simulator, which is all included in the price. You all get a go on that, and it is well worth it if you can. There's the adult only pool that I was telling you about earlier. Isn't it beautiful? As well as that, remember, you've got all your food included. You've got all those delic uh, delicious restaurants you can try, as well as the buffet where you can get all your snacks. And you've also got the pizzeria that does pizza until the early hours of the morning. And that's where you need to be. So this is Sin City, the Big Apple and the Bahamas on the Anthem of the Seas going on the 5th of February next year for 13 nights away. We're going to be flying you out from London Gatwick Airport over to Las Vegas. Now, when we get to Las Vegas, this is where you're going to be put up for two nights in the Luxor Las Vegas on a room-only basis. So we're not taking you anywhere. We're taking you to a luxury hotel, the Luxor Las Vegas. Maybe have a drive down the strip, go and see all the very famous Las Vegas lights. Then you're going to fly to New York where you've got another two-night stay. Now we're going to be putting you up in the Gallivant in Times Square, so you are right in the heart of it. Maybe go and see a Broadway show. You've got to go and have a, a taxi ride in one of the icon iconic yellow taxi cabs. Maybe go to the top of the rock, go to the top of the Empire State Building. There's so much to do. I'm sure you will be able to keep yourself entertained there. The next day you're going to be getting on board the Anthem of the Seas at Cape Liberty. And then we're going to sail you out from Cape Liberty and we're going to be going down to Orlando. Now. When you're in Orlando, you've got so much to do there. Remember, you've got all of the Universal Studios there. They've got the three parks there. You've got all the Disney parks there. You've got SeaWorld. There's loads to do. Then we're going to be selling you on to Coco Cay. Now, Coco Cay is actually Royal Caribbean's own private island, and there's so much to do there. You've got beach buffets. You've got zip wiring. You've got all sorts that you can get involved in there. Then we're going to be sailing you on to Nassau. Now, when you're in Nassau, maybe go and visit the uh, Atlantis Water Park there. That's a really great thing to do before we sail you back into Cape Liberty. And then you're going to fly from New York back to London Gatwick. So this is Sin City, the Big Apple and the Bahamas on board the Anthem of the Seas. This is going on the 5th of February next year for 13 nights away. Fares on this just £1,645 per person. Remember what it includes. You've got all your flights and your overseas transfers. You've got your two nights at the Luxor Las Vegas on a room-only basis. We're then going to fly you from Vegas to New York, where you've got two nights at the Gallivant Times Square, New York, on a room-only basis. We're then going to transfer you down to the ship at Cape Liberty. You're going to be getting on board the Anthem of the Seas for an eight-night cruise. 
All of that for that fantastic price you see on screen there of just £1,645. Let's have a look at the details, shall we? So we're going to Las Vegas, we're going to New York, and we're going to Bahamas on this Sin City, the Big Apple, and Bahamas cruise. We're going on board Royal Caribbean's Anthem of the Seas, the smart ship. There's so much to do on that before we even start going to our other destinations. You are going on the 5th of February next year for 13 nights. It's just shy of two weeks away. You're departing from London Gatwick. You're flying out to Las Vegas. You've got your two nights there. We're going to then fly you to New York. You've got a further two nights there. You're then going to join the ship where you're going to be going to Orlando in Florida to visit all the parks, then to Coco Cay, which is their private, uh, Royal Caribbean's private island, then on to Nassau before we take you back to New York and fly you back to London Gatwick that price that you can see there. For all of that, for all your overseas transfers, for all of your hotel stays, just £1,645 per person for an inside stateroom. We have discounted that there by £50 per person. That is the best price that we can see. So if you see any better prices, just give us a call. But it's 0800 011 1055. Remember, here at Cruise Savers, we like to say, why pay more? That money is better off in your pocket. Okay, talking about why paying more, let's move on to an inclusive cruise now with Norwegian Cruise Lines. Now, not only are we taking you again to the Caribbean, we're also taking you to Niagara Falls, and this time we're on board the Norwegian Breakaway. Now, the Norwegian Breakaway is the first in the Breakaway class ships. It is a beautiful ship, it's freestyle. This is H2O Spice at the back there, it's an adult only area. During the day you can sit back and relax with a cocktail, maybe in the jacuzzi. At night it turns into a full blown sort of disco and outdoor club area. You've got top deck, you saw all the water slides on there, there's so much for the kids to do. Here you can see an example of some of the state rooms, that's an ocean view you can see there. If you do want to upgrade, give us a call, we can discount all of our prices. Just give us a call. It's 0800 011 1055 and ask about it. Here's the central atrium there. You've got lots of restaurants all over the place on the ship. Some of them are there, some of them are on top deck. They're all spaced out, so you really can enjoy all the fantastic food. Here's the Manhattan dining room. There's a big ballroom dancing area in the middle there where, you know, you might want to do a bit of ballroom dancing or later on a couple more of the more current tunes get on. You can do some uh, more up-to-date dancing there as well. You've got the buffet, you've got Moderno Churrascaria, which is a, uh, a one of the speciality dining restaurants there for an extra cover charge. But remember, you've got so many restaurants that are on board without the cover charge, so you, you really can go on board this and not, pen, not spend another penny. So we're taking you around Niagara Falls and the Bahamas on the Norwegian Breakaway. We're going on the 19th of October this year for 11 nights. We're gonna be flying you from London Heathrow out to Toronto. Now Toronto in Canada, we're then going to be putting you up for two nights stay in the Sheraton on the Falls, which is there. That is it. That is your hotel. You can also maybe go up for a, um, a tour of the CN Tower or we're actually going to throw in a Voyage to the Falls boat tour with this cruise for you to enjoy. Then we're going to fly you down to New York where you've got a one night stay at the Gallivant in Times Square, which again, Times Square, you're right there. You've got Broadway. Running through the heart of it there, maybe go and see a Broadway show. Or, like I said, go and see the Statue of Liberty, go to the top of the rock. There is so much to do in New York that you will not get bored for a second. Then, we're taking you down to Cape Liberty again, where you're going to be getting on board the Norwegian Breakaway. Again, so much to do on board the ship. It's a destination in itself. But... We've got more. We're going to be tailing you to Orlando, where again, you can take the kids to go and visit the, the parks. If you haven't got kids, go and visit them yourself and be a big kid at heart. It's so much fun. Then we went to Royal Caribbean's private island before. Now we're on to Norwegian's private island, Great Stirrup K. Here you've got the fantastic beach buffet that you can eat at during the day, or you can go and do water sports. And there's so much to do there as well. Then we're on to Nassau. While you're in Nassau here, maybe go to the Adastra Zoo. That's another great little place you can go before we sail you back into New York. And then that from New York, we're going to fly you back to London Heathrow Airport. Now, the price that you can see on screen here is £1,699. We have discounted that to you today 
from 1,749, so that's a great saving you're getting there of 50 pounds per person. So 1,699 pounds per person. Remember, you're gonna get all your flights and overseas transfers included in that. You're gonna get two nights at the Sheraton on the Falls in Toronto on a room only basis. And then you're also gonna get that Voyage to the Falls boat tour. Then we're gonna fly you to New York where you're gonna get one night at the Gallivant Times Square on a room only basis before we then take you down to the ship and you've got seven nights away on the Norwegian breakaway. Not only that, you've got the premium all-inclusive package on there, which I'll tell you about more in a sec. So let's have a look at the details. Like I said, on board the ship, you've got that premium all-inclusive package. That's all your drinks, all your wines, beers, spirits, cocktails, up to the value of $15 a glass. And believe me, there's not a huge amount that's over that. You've also got all your tips and gratuities paid for. So you pay that price that you see on screen, of £1,699 and you don't have to pay another penny while you're on holiday. You don't have to pay another penny while you're on the ship. You can choose to. You can choose to do some of the speciality dining. You can pamper yourself in the spa. You can maybe go and uh, enjoy some duty-free shopping, but you really can get on board that ship and not spend another penny. If this is the cruise for you, all you have to do is give us a call. It's 0800 011 1055. That's 0800 011 1055. And just remember all of that other great holiday that you've got there. You've got the stay in New York. You've got the stay at Niagara Falls. I mean, what isn't there to like about this holiday? Anyway, moving on, we're going back with Royal Caribbean this time. And this time we're on one of their big, big ships. We're on the Oasis of the Seas. Now, the Oasis of the Seas is actually the third largest ship in the world now. Her sister ship, the Allure, took over and then the newest one, the Harmony, took over after that. But this was originally the largest ship in the world. And you can see why. There is so much that they've crammed in to the largest ship. You've got the atrium here where there's entertainment. You've got the arcades. You've got a carousel on board. You've got these cantilevered jacuzzis, which I know cantilever is quite a fancy word. It just means it hangs off the side of the ship. You've got the Viking Crown Lounge where you can go and enjoy um, a, a drink there. You've got the ice rink where you can go and see one of the ice shows. You've got the water park on top deck. You've got the flow riders. You have got so much to do. You've got all that evening entertainment. The kids clubs on board are absolutely fantastic. This is a fantastic cruise to take the kids on, especially when I tell you where we are going. We're taking you around the Western and Eastern Caribbean this time. We're going on the 25th of November this year for 16 nights away. So firstly, we are going to start by flying you from London Gatwick Airport out to Orlando. Here in Orlando, maybe visit one of the parks before you get on board the ship. Then we are going to get you on board the Oasis of the Seas. You're going to have overnight in Orlando. You've got that one night stay there before we do. And then we are going to take you down to the port and you are going to get on board the Oasis of the Seas. Like I said, there is so much to do on here. You can see the aqua theatre at the back there where they have diving shows, high diving shows, and also aerial acrobatics that take place every single night that you can enjoy. We're going to sail you to Labadee. That is the... Uh, private island for uh, Royal Caribbean there in Haiti. You're going to visit that there. Then we're on to Falmouth in Jamaica. Maybe going to uh, see where the Ochos Rio rivers converge into the Duns River Falls. That's a great little day trip to go on there. Then we're on to Cozumel here in Mexico. You can swim with dolphins or if you're a little bit more adventurous, you can do what I did while I was there and swim with some whale sharks in the wild. It is one of the best experiences you will ever have before we then sail you back into Orlando. So after that, we are going to fly you back to London Gatwick Airport before we take you on to St. Martin. Now, St. Martin is a lovely place. Again, you've got all that Dutch and uh, French heritage there. Sorry, we're not taking you home there. I, uh, I jumped the gun there. Then we're on to San Juan in uh, Puerto Rico. Here you can go and see the old San Juan town, or you can maybe go and have a visit around the cathedral. Then we're going to give you another chance to go to Royal Caribbean's private island, where you can uh, go and maybe try some zip wiring, try some water sports. There's so much to do there. Before then, we take you back to Orlando, and this time we fly you back to London Gatwick Airport. That price that you can see on screen there, £1,599. It was £1,649. And as well as that, that discount there that we've given you £50 per person, we're giving you $200 per stateroom on board credit to spend as well. Let's have a look at the details. So we are going around the Western and Eastern Caribbean on the Oasis of the Seas. We're going on the 25th of November 
um, this year for 16 nights, flying you out of London Gatwick, going around all those fantastic ports and then sailing you back. That price there, £1,599. And as well as that, you've also got that $200 per stateroom onboard credit. If that's the cruise for you, give us a call. It's 0800 011 1055 or visit our website, www.cruisesavers.co.uk. That's all for me. I'll see you next time. Bye bye. Thanks for watching Cruise Savers, a commercial presentation on behalf of Cruise Savers UK.